let me start by congratulating you on this new venture. What, why was there a need for you to um, set up Bamoral Center? Um, in Sheraton. Yes. Um, so, as you know, we are, we have the Bamoral Convention Center in VI, okay. um, in uh, Federal Palace Hotel. Okay. So we looked around and we found out that, you know, most of the in fact, most of the clients we get from um, Federal Palace okay. are actually mainland people. Okay. And we looked around, exhibition market as well, to, you know, closer to the airport, mm -hmm. hotel. There was no proper, proper venue on the mainland okay. that could do, like, concerts, that could do, like, international events and all of that. So we thought, we saw the opportunity to partner with Sheraton, which is an international hotel. So, I mean, it was a no-brainer for us to come up with a befitting event center for the mainland. Okay, can you tell us a bit about the facilities available here? Okay, so we have a venue, a world-class venue, um, that can sit about 2,500 for banquet and about four to 5,000 for um, conferences and concerts. It comes with also with a studio. Uh, means that, I mean, there's a cream studio here. It means that people can come in. Um, artists can come and do a recording. Live mm. bands can come and do their own recording as well to uh, just go into the venue and perform. Um, it's situated on a, in a very premium location. Mm -hmm. Exhibitions is exhibition ready because we've also done all the cabling for exhibitions and all of that. I mean, so it's, we've taken a lot into because we've taken almost about fifteen to sixteen years of experience and what we have learned to now put into a venue that we are all proud of, and I'm mm -hmm. sure Lagosians and Nigerians will be proud of okay. what we've been able to put here as well. Too. Okay. Okay. So so far, uh, like how many? venues we have the Bamoral. So the Bamora group now have about five venues in Lagos. We have uh, the Bamora Convention Center in VI. We have a small Bamora Hall in VI as well too, which can take about 200 people. We have the Villa Bahala. We have um, Bamora Hall Oregon and then we have the Bamora Convention Center Sheraton now. Okay. So that's five venues. Okay. How about the... And the, and the Haven as well. The Haven. I was yes, going to say so six, six, okay. six venues. Okay. Um, um, going by experience, what are the uh, how do you how do you look how do you see the evolution of the event center business? Well, I know you've been around for uh, close to twenty. I mean, years. Now we like you know, event center didn't start this way. We were actually one of the people that saw the um, the rise of event centers because if you know before now, people you normally do parties on the streets, block up the whole road, and all of that. It become an issue until fashion light came in and banned street parties and all of that. So it keeps growing and keeps growing. We are not there yet. There's still a long way to go because with exhibit, with, uh, with, uh, with venues, that's where you find out that venues attract tourism into the country. Venues is also one place that, you know, international exhibitors can come in and partner with local businesses. So you see that there's still a huge potential for venues and I mean, the right venues as well. And as we keep growing, the venue business keep evolving as well too. I mean, the standards, keep improving. Like we've gone at the days where you can just have a land, put just put a tent there and say so you have a venue. Now we are I mean we are changing the game where venues now has to be conformed to international standard as well. So I mean we are getting there and that we are championing that to ensure that we revolutionize the whole event space in Nigeria. Okay. I also know you do um um I don't know what to call it professionally now, but where I tell you, I want to do my event. mobile, 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 mobile. Do you still do that? No, we yeah, set up and all that. So we hardly do that now. We focus basically on four major parts of events now. We mean, namely, um, venues, hospitality, live events, and exhibitions. I mean, those are our core now. Um, when you call us and say oh, we want to set up a marquee somewhere, it has to be, it has to be worth it. It has to be a proper event. We won't just you won't call us now and say, Oh, I have a birthday party for this, we'll go there and all of that. We're actually doing more of um corporate and more of um um impact events now than uh, just the regular moving around. Okay. So what stands uh, the Bamora group um apart from the other so Bamora is a three sixty event solutions company as a group of companies. Like I said to you, Bamora probably is the only event company that's major in those four major Part of event, we are a 360 event solutions company. It means we provide for solution for everything about event. We are not just a venue company; we are a events company. Last year, I know you, I don't know if you heard about the Wonderland event. We did a Wonderland event last year. Um, we are also coming up with another event this year called Cultureland. So we keep evolving and we keep changing the narrative of the event space. 
we are one of the biggest, we are the leaders in the event space. So when it comes to Bamora, I think we're actually pace setters when it comes to events, business in Nigeria. Okay.